Bogdan, obviously you weren't able to uh, to fight tonight. Is it frustrating having to watch as a spectator tonight? It is frustrating, but uh, you know I'm enjoying the show, so it's also also good. Um, I'm looking forward for what's next. So now it's uh, it's all about uh, what's gonna gonna happen tonight. Also, like the the the, the main event is gonna be really interesting. Jimmy and Rakic also. So that all of that could be possibility for what's next. So I'm gonna enjoy the show as a spectator and see uh, also what can unfold in front of me. UFC officially announced the uh, Copenhagen. Would you like to take a part uh, in it, or uh, you rather uh, want to you know, get back to Abidjan earlier? Yeah, I really want to fight. Uh, I really wanted to fight soon after my last fight, and now you know this happened again. So um, it's really bad luck. But uh, Copenhagen, Copenhagen is a little bit uh, far away, you know, in in a schedule. I would love to go back there um, earlier, but it also has to make sense um, on what fight and when and who, who whoever is going to be next need to be ready too. So it's all in. Uh, it's all going to be into discussion. So, uh, when exactly are you looking to get back in that case, and who do you think makes sense? I mean, you're talking about the main event, the co-main event, but you don't know they might get injured, something like that. It could be tough fights. Is there anyone else in the division that you feel it would be a good fight for you? So, I really want, uh, first of all, to avenge my, my last losses. You know, it was a really controversial decision. Uh, I have a strong feeling the fight was mine, and, and, and so my opponent, too. I think he was gifted the, the victory, and I want to make the thing right. Uh, other than that, you know, he has to, he has to, he has to be also, he has to make sense too with, uh, with also the winner of tonight. My goal is obviously to go back into title contention. So you know, one of those uh, ranked guy, you know, with a good victory or whatever, you know, is going to be a nice, uh, is going to be a nice choice. And the Latifi pullout came very tight up until the fight. Uh, how exactly was the process? When exactly did you find out? What did the UFC tell you? So I find out um, right before I was uh, about to jump into the sauna. Uh, I was getting ready. I was in my room uh, changing and uh, as soon as I came back out of the, you know, um, I was in the bathroom actually. As soon as I came back out of the bathroom, every all my coaches, everybody were sitting on, on the bed and uh, they called my name. They say Vulcan and I was like, okay, something happened, you know. And uh, they just told me the fight is cancelled, the Ilir pulled his back, you know, it's, uh, it's, it's over, so it was a little bit, uh, you know, I had some moments for me to process, you know, but then um, what can you do, there is st stuff like that you have no control on, so now it's all about, uh, you know, what's coming next and we, we will see, uh, we will see what uh, the future reserves me. And compensation, did you get show money? I got compensated by the UFC, so it's, uh, it's good, you know. Obviously, uh, the, the, the biggest thing will be for me to fight, you know, because that's what I came for. Uh, this is how you get, this is the real, you know, um, compensation, is to fight, you know. To get in there, you know, to do what you do best and uh, get, get a victory back. Did you enjoy yesterday during the session that you've been part of? Do you like such interaction with the fans? Can, the, can you repeat? Do you, uh, did you enjoy the Q&A session which was uh, taken uh, yesterday? Did yeah, so like? um, Q&A was nice for me, you know, it's, it's good to be here, so uh, to produce, you know, to be productive a little bit instead of just sitting here on the sideline. I don't want to be sitting on a bench, you know, like uh, I feel like a, a soccer player that can't, can't play, you know. So at least I can do some stuff and uh, waiting for my next fight. Where did you hide your glasses from the media day? Oh, my media, uh, the glasses is, uh, is home now. You know, I have a suit, so now it's enough. It looks on point, thank you very much. Thank you, man. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.